Good morning, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. It's millions by nephews, nephew to boss. We talk about stocks, trading, um, dividends, growth stocks, like I said, crypto, all that good stuff. In this video, I want to talk about Tesla. Tesla is dropping. Yesterday, it was shot up all the way, almost, it, it almost touched a thousand dollars a share. What's going on with Tesla? Why is it dropping? We're going to talk about that in this video. So what's really going on with Tesla? Obviously, the price has been shooting up. It's been growing. It's been in the uptrend for quite some time. You can see the charts. It's been it's been on the uptick the whole time, from all the way all the way from down here. And you can see the price just never stopped going up. It's just been on a constant growth. Now, I like this these type of stocks that I'm looking for ones that are um, in this position where they just keep going up like that. I'm I'm in love with these type of stocks. So let's let me see if I can show you the the the, the point the, the 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 day that it reversed and it went back up. It was around this price, one seventy seven. So if you had been if you had been thinking about Tesla back in June last year, you could have got it at one hundred and seventy seven dollars a share, and it only took about it's not even a full year because six months would take you to January. And let's, let's go find out where you would be six months later. This is why I'm looking at this is because you have to have patience for this, right? This is such a long-term trade to a certain extent, but come on now, how long-term is it? You buy something in June and then six months later, you up. So let's go see where January is at. This is six months later, six months later. That's November, December, 2020. So you would be at $424 a share. And then... It's not even a month later that the price is at, let's see, uh, right there, 700, almost double where it was at just in the same month. And then if you wait a little longer, uh, a couple of days later, boom, it shot up some more. Now, at some point, you got to sell this because how much percent are you trying to make? Now, you went from... $177 to twice that, to three times that, to four times that, then you made for 100%, man. And at that point, that's when I'm going to hit the sell button because I want to pull my money out and preserve it. I'm not trying to lose nothing back. And whoever hit the sell button at 400, 450, 460 or whatever they had, they, they was right. They got rid of it. They dropped it. And look what happened. It dropped down. Not to say that it won't go back up, but it's good to get out and then buy back in. So, let me see. So, I'm going to go over here. And you can see the price is now starting to trend back downward. So, what's really happening with Tesla? The reason why I believe that it's really going down right now is because of the coronavirus. It's been uh, slowing down their production. Obviously, they haven't been able to get these cars out. They said the delivery has been slow. The vice president of Tesla over there. He said that, yo, um, the outbreak of the Tesla virus is causing us to have slow delivery. So that's what happened to the stock price and the stock price went down. So anybody who was shorting this, they got a payday. Everything worked out for them. But I would have been afraid to short. But at some point, it can't keep going up forever. If it's a strong stock, it has to, you know, it has to rebound. It has to be some type of retraction. Some type of retraction has to come through. So that's what happened. You know, nothing to be alarmed. But I mean, if you're a Tesla lover, I mean, let me know where you think the price point is going to be. If you don't like Tesla, tell me how far down you think it's going to go. Um, drop that in the comments below. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button, guys. I like Tesla. I'm waiting on the price to come back down a little bit. Um, things can't do well forever. Obviously, that was an uptrend. that came back from a downtrend. It was a rebound. I'm looking for stocks that do this on a regular basis. So if you're on this channel... I'm going to be finding a lot of stocks that I feel like have the potential to go from 100 to, you know, 400 percent return. Um, also, I'm also going to be picking some stocks out that I feel like might be in like a short term increase of 20 or 30, 40 percent, you know, decent stuff like that. And if you're into options, you can also turn these 100 percent into 500 percent and the 2000 percent, depending on when you buy the option trade. A little bit more advanced stuff. But like I said, this is all educational purposes only. I'm not licensed. I'm only here. Just for educational purposes and i'm just trying to do this for myself 
I'm trading this stuff myself. So these are just ideas or trading ideas. So if you follow the challenges, make sure you do your own research and you talk to a professional. All right, guys, talk to you later. Peace.